Lord is my shepherd. There is nothing I shall want. This is the psalm that we sing this coming weekend at the 16th Sunday of Ordinary Time. Have you ever been to a dog park? A dog park. I used to go all the time with our uh, golden retriever. And so, you know, he would frolic around with all the dogs and, you know, they would do dog stuff. Well, when it was time to go home, I would make this very specific sound that only he would kind of perk up and respond to. And he could be, you know, a hundred yards across this park. And I would make this kind of overly loud kissy sound. Let me try here. <clears throat> I'm in a church, but... And that would be it. And his ears would perk up and he'd come to me and it would be time to go home. Um, this is very reminiscent of what's happening in the readings this weekend. This idea of needing a shepherd, a shepherd to lead the flock. The Lord is my shepherd, right? And this is all over the readings. And we learn about good shepherds and bad shepherds. For instance, in the first reading, we learn about a bad shepherd. And Jeremiah reads like this. Woe to the shepherds who mislead and scatter the flock of my pasture, says the Lord. I myself will gather the remnant of my flock from all the lands to which I have driven them and bring them back to their meadow. So woe to those bad shepherds, right? Well, in second reading, we start to read about some good shepherding. St. Paul says that Christ has now gathered all the people of the world to Jesus Christ through what he accomplished on the cross. All are gathered to him and those who are in friendship with God now have peace. And in the gospel reading, Jesus is preaching in a deserted place to all of these people and he kind of looks his heart is moved by these people, and this is what it says. His heart was moved with pity for them, for they were like sheep without a shepherd, and he began to teach them many things. And so very naturally in the psalm response, we sing about shepherding. And the theme of the psalm is simple, is that in this broken world, we need a shepherd, someone to take care of us, and the Lord promises that he will. This is Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd. And I shall dwell in the house of the Lord. 